Welcome to Duel Night. This is a brand new draft series where four players take their deck building and dueling skills to the next level. Starting chronologically from the very first booster set, each player gets the draft from the deck box containing three of every card from the current set. It goes like this. The booster set for each episode will be divided into four piles. One for each player to draft a single card from and switching piles afterwards until there are no more cards left to draft. Each duelist comes up with a 40 card deck using their drafted cards, dueling one another in a best of one. The winners of each duel will proceed to the finals battling for the title of champion. The victor gets the spin from the magical wheel, allowing them to pick a card from the deck box on the following episode. The deck box continuously builds as each set progresses, adding the best cards from previous sets to the arsenal. Watch as the four of us duel it off to see who can become the master of Duel Knight. Let's begin. Welcome to episode number two of Duel Knight. Today we are going to be expanding our deck box by including the cards from the second ever Yu-Gi-Oh set Metal Raiders. Metal Raiders is the second ever booster set to ever come out in the Yu-Gi-Oh trading card game. It was released back in June 26, 2002. Metal Raiders is the very first booster set to include counter trap cards such as Magic Jammer and Seven Tools of the Bandit. As you guys can see on the top right of Magic Jammer, you can see the arrow indicating that this card is a counter trap card. What Magic Jammer does is that when a spell card is activated, you can discard one card, negate the activation, if you do, destroy it. So counter trap cards are built to obviously counter your opponent. A very powerful counter trap card that is also introduced in this set is the almighty Solemn Judgment. This card allows you to pay half your life points to negate the summon of a monster or the activation of a spawn trap. What's really awesome about Metal Raiders is that it has a wide selection of effect monsters compared to the few in the previous set, Legend of Blue Eyes White Dragon. Some of the most iconic monsters in this set include Sangan, Witch of the Black Forest, and Magician of Faith. This set also introduced the iconic Summon Skull. Summon Skull is a level 6 monster with a stat line of 2500 attack and 1200 defense. What makes Summon Skull so powerful is that it only costs one tribute to summon a 2500 attack beat stick. This card is insane. Highly sought after cards in this set include Time Wizard, Mirror Force, Change of Heart, Solemn Judgment, and Heavy Storm. The main cover card for this set is Black Skull Dragon, which uses Red Eyes Black Dragon and Summon Skull to make this very powerful fusion monster. That's pretty much it for the history of Metal Raiders. Without further ado, let's bring on the players and get started on episode number two of Duel Knight. I'm finally back, episode two, you already know. We won episode one, so here I am. I'm allowed to spin the wheel now, which lets me pick one monster spell or trap card, depending on what I get from Metal Raiders. Uh, where's that, where's that wheel? Oh, of course, there it is. So on the wheel, there are monsters, spells, and traps. And whatever I land on, I get to pick a free card from that category and add it to my new Metal Raiders draft deck. Wheel spin! Monster! Ah, that's not really what I was going for, but I'm sure there's lots of cards that I can pick and choose from, so I'm excited to see what I come up with. Yo, what up guys? It's Denzel, back again. Metal Raiders this time. I'm a little salty from last time. Couldn't get out the first round, but this week is different. I'm coming for you, Triff. It's my week. I got this. Yo, what's up everyone? I'm back another episode with my boy Sam. Uh, last week I made it to the finals, this week I gotta make the finals, except I gotta win. I can't lose to Milano again. I gotta win. Don't get revenge, baby. So I'm excited. Let's go. All right, guys, it's Sam back here again today. 
We're diving straight in into Metal Raiders. This set is super awesome. So many powerful monsters, new effect monsters are coming into play now, especially with the addition of powerful spell cards such as Change of Heart and powerful trap cards like Mirror Force. Guys, this set is full of fun and cannot wait to see on what everybody drafts within their decks. All right, guys, Metal Raiders time. Guys, remember, this is the cube. Four piles, without further ado, are you guys all ready? Yes. Well, okay. Well, did you pick your card already? I already picked my card. Okay, all right, okay, we're, we're ready? All right, let's begin. Dual Ops, what? Oh my, oh yes. <laughs> bad. Oh, oh my god. god. Oh god, this is- There's so many oh, cards. Oh my lord, this was a terrible idea. This is so <laughs> many <laughs> cards. <laughs> All right, guys, so we're gonna do the same thing again. This is gonna determine who we face off in the very second episode of Duel Night. What I'm shuffling right now is two blue eyes and two dark magicians. Whoever matches each other gets to duel each other. It's two right. Zodias. No, it's two dark magicians. Oh, wow. So, each of you guys pick one. All right. And good luck. All right, guys, here we go. Three, two, one. Ah! Ready? Ready? No, no, ready? You put them together. Three. One, two, three. You're losing! You're losing! You're not the guy, You're losing! I got the feet, man! Let's go, let's go, let's go! Let's go hard! So, Steven. <laughs> Steven! Steven! <laughs> Sam, this is the perfect matchup for me. I know Sam loves Exodia. My Robin Goblin is gonna discard every Exodia piece in his hand. Got Milano. I mean, it's not Steven, but if he can make the finals, I guess I'll see him there. Denzel? Oh man, I beat Steven last week and Steven beat Denzel and by my math, I'm pretty sure I got this. But good luck to Denzel. He's gonna need it. All right guys, so we just finished drafting and here is my deck list. The card that I decided to pick off of the wheel was Sangen. The reason why I picked Sangan was because Sangan, when it's sent to the graveyard, allows me to search for a lot of monsters with 1500 or less attack for my deck to my hand, letting me get any type of utility cards and searching my deck, making it more consistent. I also decided to go with Big Eye. The reason why I played Big Eye is because when it's flipped, I'm able to look at the top five cards in my deck and rearrange them in any order, similar to Sangan, letting me fix up my hand and tutor out whatever I need from the deck. And the last card I picked was Time Wizard. And now the reason I picked Time Wizard was because Joey's Red Eyes gave me lots of good luck last week, and I think I could translate this luck to the coin flip. And that's why Time Wizard is gonna destroy my opponent's entire field every time I use it. All right guys, just finished the draft. Here's my deck list. All right, guys, same strategy as last week. You already know what it is. Metal Raiders now, so we got a bit more better cards this time around. So what we have here is first, our boy Aquamador. He's gonna be the defense for the deck. 2,000 defense, nobody getting through him. And next up, we have the change of heart. So this time around, we're using Aquamador to beef up the defense and change of heart to snatch their monster away. And once we got two monsters on field, you guys already know what it is. Ain't nothing changed. We got three of them boys, the Dark Magician, ready to defeat the opponent and take the victory this week. I got you guys this time. We just finished drafting. My deck is insane. I can't believe let me get all these cards. This is my deck list. The main strategy of my deck, I drafted every single beater, every single big attack monster, like Skull Red Bird. Nothing in my deck has less attack than 1500. Everyone's monsters, I got them all. How are they gonna attack me when other monsters are small? And the next strategy to pair with all these high attack monsters and it's such a rudimentary way to play Yu-Gi-Oh! is Robin Goblin. 
Robin Goblin is a continuous trap card that every time my monster inflicts battle damage to my opponent, they have to discard a card. So seeing as how I have all the high attack monsters combined with three Robin Goblins and it's continuous that they can't get rid of, I'm just going to be discarding cards for days. Or any stall strategy, they're done. It's over. And then to make sure my strategy worked, I made sure to draft every single heavy storm so they're not used against me so my strategy will work and so I'll win. Alright guys, so I just finished drafting and I believe I have the best deck in the entire room. Here's my deck list. As you guys can see by my deck list, you guys already know, one of my main strategies is to stall with swords of revealing light. Three of them things. Stalling for nine turns is pretty good. Next to pair off of my stalling strategy, I got high defense monsters such as Mystical Elf. Mystical Elf is amazing, 2,000 defense to pair off alongside swords of revealing light. You guys know the drill. This is my main strategy. Here it comes. Guys, my grandpa once told me that my deck has no pathetic cards. So my main strategy is to summon Exodia. Yes, guys, last week this is my strategy. It kind of failed, but hey, as you guys saw my deck list, got three swords, two regeki, two dark holes, a bunch of stall monsters, sword and shield. I'm bringing out Exodia. Let's do it. Let's go. Hi, Steven. Good luck. Good luck, my brother. Rock, paper, scissors. Let's do it. Rock, no shoot. Just okay. normal. Rock, paper, scissors. Yeah. Okay. Rock, paper, scissors. Rock, paper, scissors. Got him. Wait a second. You're going first. Okay. All right. Good luck. It's time to duel. Let's go. All right. Here we go, baby. All right, Steven. Yes, sir. I'm gonna start off with something very simple. I'm gonna set one card face down, Whoa. and then I'm gonna pass my turn to you. <sighs> Just one set card face down. I'm scared. I draw. Yes, sir. Oh, how much should I do? How, um, how many cards do you have here? Right? I could five, <laughs> <Nine>, six. <laughs> okay. You know, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to set two. Set two back row. Wow. Bye, mother. That's not your turn. That's it. All yes, right. sir. I draw for turn. Ooh. Draw one of my combo pieces. Uh oh. Here we go, go, baby. Please don't do this. Here we go. I am my turn. Oh, okay. I draw. And my turn then. Draw. Oh, this gonna halt my strategy. Ready? I activate. Milanos. Favorite card of the last. What is it? Stop the bench. Big defense monster. No problem, baby. That's why I drafted this spell card. Oh! Card to attack position. Are you sure, it stops face down. Yes, it does. Stop the fence. Guys, I hate this card. This is the only card that ruins me. If it's face up, flip it face up. Oh, that's it. Flip it face up. It just flip it face up, right? Yeah. In attack position. Oh, switch. Oh, wow. Yeah. Whoa, that's like Spirit of the Heart. Spirit of the Heart, baby. My next move. Kirby! The dinosaur! Okay. What? Huge attack. Okay, 1500. But it's not over yet. Oh my god. But it's not over. Flip! The best card what, 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 of this entire draft. What is it? That everyone slept on. Robin Goblin. What is this card give? <laughs> That's your demise, Sam. What does this card give? Every single time I inflict battle damage to you, you, you have to discard a random card from your hand. Oh, okay. That's I'm cool. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Cool. Enter battle phase. My herb is going to attack your spirit of the heart for 700 damage. Okay. Robin Goblin will discard a card from your hand at random. Okay, so I just shuffle my hand like this? Yes, I'll okay. pick one. And then you, you pick one. Yes. One, two, three, pen best deck. Shooting sword, nice. Wow, that was that's an incredible card. I would have bought this to eight hundred. Nice, nice pick. Nice Thank pick. you, man. Thank you. Nice I appreciate pick. that a lot. All right, and here are four cards. I'm at four cards, and I lost seven hundred. Yes, and right. I'll pass to you. Draw for turn. Wow, I just top decked the perfect card. Um, I activate the card. Sword to the Oh my, this card haunts me. <laughs> I'm Yugi, baby. Stalling for three turns. My number one strategy: swords of revealing light. How many times does a human being have to play against this one card? This card allows me to stall for three turns. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, Steven, that's pretty much it. This can card. I, can I pass my turn to you? Oh, this card wants me. I draw. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Just a laugh because. No problem. I understand. This card allows me to stall for three turns. I understand. I understand. I said one. 
That's it. Three, That's it. Control turn. Wow, please pass. I am missing one combo pieces. I'm gonna pass my turn. Oh no. You have a five? Oh no, please don't play it. So you okay. Draw. Oh, this card will help me maybe next to one. Next, uh, next to one. <laughs> I'll have to pass my turn to you. Pass your turn? Yes. Okay. Alright. So that's two turns now. Uh yes, two turns and uh, so this is just stop that, I think. No, no, it, it is two turns. So then next turn will be the third and we die. Okay. Okay, so I draw my turn. Um Well unfortunately, man, Steven, I cannot do anything. So I have to pass my I turn. I love to you here, man. I'm gonna draw one card. Yes, sir. And I'm gonna have to pass my turn to you, and I'm gonna watch that Swords of Rhythm Light hit the graveyard. Alright, since it's the third turn, Swords of Rhythm Light is now destroyed. Yes. Well, it's to be graveyard. Yes. Alright, so now open up to attacks. Yes. That won't matter. Uh oh. Draw. Wow. Please don't have. This is very good. That's not good for me. This is very, very good, Steven. But this is not good for very me. Very good. Maybe for you. Alright, Steven, I'm gonna go another Swords of Rhythm Light. Oh my god, this card! Haunts me! Do you guys know what's better than one sword of Reading Light? Two? Honestly, I'm a little sad that I have to wait six turns in total, but he's delaying the inevitable. This card allows you to solve for three more turns. <sighs> Are you like Yugi? I have mixed name. with the rare hunter with 30 Exodia pieces? Pass this up to my hand. I'm very scared. I'm almost gonna accomplish my goal. Oh my there god. Go. Okay, and I draw. Oh, this is not good for me. Do you have heavy storm, Steven? No. <laughs> oh, are you serious? I'm not fast, my dear. Whoa, <laughs> that's one turn off Swords of Relay. Oh my god. Alright, draw. Wow. This is amazing. This is actually very, very amazing. Uh, Steven, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to do something very simple, okay? I am just. Oh, this card gets flipped up because of Swords of Relay. Wow, that is a really great giant soldier stone. So guys, we had a mishap there. Uh, when this card is activated, he has to flip that card. Yes. But it's still, it is still one turn of yes. Swords of Reading Light. And what I'm gonna do next is super duper simple. I'm just going to set one mysterious card. And my turn. That's gonna reveal five pieces of Exodia. <laughs> and my turn. Draw one card. Yeah, your turn, Steve. I don't want to discard, man. I'm gonna have to... Very close. Yes, sir. What? Maybe yeah, swap. <laughs> <laughs> so, this is two, so you got your turn? Yes. So this is two turns off Swords of Rhythm Light. Yes. Draw a turn, that means I have one more turn. Alright, Steven, this is when something really interesting is gonna happen. Okay, Steven? This is gonna get very interesting. Do I have six cards in my hand? Seven. Seven. I have seven cards in my hand. Um, I am just going to. Hmm. One card piece now. Oh, that's so interesting. And end my turn. Okay. I draw! Yes, sir. Those are good! You have seven cards in your hand as well? At the moment, yes, sir. Okay. Alright, my next move. What's your next move? It's your last turn of swords. Okay. Next turn, it's over. Right. That's right. It's over. Okay, okay for you, right, my right. friend. I normal summon the powerful Kaji Kokosi! Okay, okay. That's a pretty big board. Thank you! Pass turn. Pass turn? Yeah. Alright, so now since the third turn, I mean, yes. the sixth turn. If you activate a third sword, we're really light. What's I am going to. So it's just scoop? I'm gonna cry. Okay, you're gonna cry. Alright, okay. Cry. Please don't right. make me cry. So now when I drop a turn because I am Yugi. Yes. Wow. I'm, I have all the pieces. Just kidding. Just, oh, thank God. Thank God, man. Alright, Steven. That hard time. If you were decking me, I'm flipping the table. Uh, do you like magic cards? I'm not a fan of them. No, please don't. Please don't. Love Dark Hole. Oh my god. Uh huh. Uh huh. I'll do it. If it gets it, it is. I, I, it's, it gets it. I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> Ready? Steven has so many monsters on the field at this point. Regeki's just gonna wipe him out. What is it? I activate my spell card. Regeki. No! <laughs> Now, this is what my favorite thing is. All right, Steven? Don't do it. I am going to summon Baby Dragon! <laughs> Baby Dragon! Don't do it. Attack! <laughs> first damage. So now I lost 700 before, and you are at 68. Yes. Right, that's first damage on you. Good job, Joey. And uh, that's pretty much all I, uh, all I have for you today. All right. Turn. I draw. Well, you have seven cards in your hand, though. That's a lot of cards. Yes. To my five. Hi, Lumosame! Skull Red Bird! Oh, that's pretty big. That's pretty big. 
It is. It is all right. Yes. And next, I'm going to enter the battle phase. Okay. And attack the Baby the Dragon! That's fine. Okay, Baby the Dragon is now going to be destroyed. 300 feet damage. And discarding one card, thanks to Robin Goblin. This okay. is the best card in the world. The Robin Goblin is a really good card. Thank you. Really good strategy. Shh, shh, what are you thinking? Shh. Robin Goblin. This card is insane. No. The Time Wizard. The time Wizard. Oh you hit, my. You hit my Time Wizard. I was gonna use Time Wizard earlier in that battle. Are, are you Joey? I'm Joey and you. I think you are. Ready? I think you're both. Ready? I'm gonna have to pass my turn to you. Pass your turn? Yes. Well, that uh, right. Robin Goblin is a really strong card. That's a great card. Draw. Wow, this is not helping me. But what I am going to do is, uh, Steven. Steven, Steven, even Steven. Attack it, my Fisher. Oh my, how many times do I have to deal with this? Okay, this card allows you to destroy a face up monster on the field. Yes. Okay, now, what is that? One? Of course. And I have my turn. Alright. Draw! Hey, man. Hmm. Robin Goblin is a very good issue. Yeah, I, I dropped a three! Yeah. Wow, this is very uh -huh. uh -huh. Thank you. Really good. Thank you. My next move, I'm gonna activate Tribute to the Doom! Okay. Discarding one card from my hand. Yes. Just like one monster in the field and destroy it. Yes, unfortunately I have to use one of my pieces as a defense mechanism. I told you! I knew he was gonna do it! Listen, Sam is not slick, he's not no rare hunter! But well, he probably is because he's playing Zodia, but it's all good. I'm a win. You're playing Zodia? Yes, sir. Any cards in your hand? Four. Four. Oh my god, I gotta win as soon as possible before I lose this duel. <laughs> Alright, my next move. I know what's going on! Again? I dropped a three! That's insane. The bear with my Robin Goblin! Wow. And next, I'm gonna rob you of 15, 50 life points and wow. a card in your hand. Guys, get card in my hand. Exhort you the forbidden, forbidden one. What is it? Oh my god, you guessed it right. At this point, how am I supposed to play Yu-Gi-Oh? He keeps taking cards out of my hand! Oh my god. This is oh. not looking good, man. <laughs> I love to hear this. That's oh, right, it's kind of dark. Set one card face down. Yes. Yeah, my turn. Draw! Oh, this card. This is the card that my friend, Milano, told me to play. And I'm gonna use it to honor him! I almost have a witch in the Black Forest! Oh my god. Oh, so that means if you attack me twice, I lose two cards? Oh <laughs> uh, I have to read. <laughs> Each time one of your monsters inflicts damage, your opponent's life points, one card is randomly discarded! This card too! That's broken. Wow. <laughs> attack! <laughs> so, what's my life now? I just lost 27 15, so now you get to choose two cards. Mom! Mom! Oh, am I? Oh my god, I was waiting for Paul to say shit. Yep, that's it. And I'm about to do Heart of the Cards. Oh, there you go. You're gonna need it. Hooey! Oh, oh. I'm scared. My turn. Okay. Drop! <laughs> 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 I never understand why Yugi would decide to trip you two monsters for Dark Magician, but for the same attack, you can trip you one and get Summon Skull. Summon Skull! One tribute, 2500. Trivia the effect of which? Of the Black Forest. What's the effect? To add a monster with 1500 or less defense from my deck to my hand. No problem. <laughs> Let's see. This is a Yugi moment right here. Thank you. you ready for this? I'm ready. You're not ready for this. Robin Goblin is insane. It's the best card in Yu-Gi-Oh. Wow. Adding the Trinity, the third Skull Rider! Wait, almost on this guy. It's okay. I'm saving him for next time. Alright, please. And then, next. What's your life points? My 2800. Your 2800. Yes, sir. I'm gonna enter Battle Face. Enter Battle Face. Attack with Summon Skull. That's fine. Exodia. Exodia. Huh. There goes my Exodia strategy. Grandpa, where are you? Where are you? Where are you, Grandpa? He took all my three pieces of the hand. <laughs> I did that. Attack with Skull Red Bird! <laughs> you can actually <laughs> rub it on one! You won't know. You discarded my guy. Gaia. Honestly, bro, I just needed polymerization, you man. You did, man. 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 Oh, Polly would have seen you. I'm gonna have to pass my turn. Alright, ready? Wait, one card left, Yuki Joey. Oh, 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 oh. 
Summon the card, the witch of the black forest from my friend Milano. He told me, Skull Red Bird. That's fine. That's our game. That is game. <laughs> Peaches. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Where's my defense? Where's my defense? There she is. My grandpa's deck has no pathetic cards. My Exodia deck failed me. <laughs> Good luck to Steven in the finals. He's going to need it. Good luck. Good luck, Steven! On to the finals, baby. Second week in a row. Let's go. Do this! Are you ready? Absolutely. Get destroyed by my new strategy that I've developed specifically to win the second week in a row? No, definitely not. Alright, let's let's do our RPS. Rock, paper, scissors. Rock, paper, scissors. Ah! ah. All right, I'll go second. Uh, yeah, I'll go second. Good luck. Good luck, duelist. <laughs> okay. <laughs> For my turn, I will set one mysterious card face down, and I'll have to end my turn. All right, I'll draw. I'll play down one face down monster and one face down spell or trap card, and then I'll pass. Draw for my turn. Okay, okay. Alright. For my turn, I will flip my monster. Hain Hain. Flip, Hain Hain, back to your hand. Wide open field, easy money. Hain Hain? Whatever, I'll just normal summon it next turn. And then I will normal summon. The Harpy Lady. The finest girl in the game. I'm a Harpy Lady. <laughs> and I, I will, will enter my battle phase. Attack for 1300. I gotta take that 1300. And attack for 450. <laughs> All right. And then I will set one mysterious card face down and end my journey. Draw! I'll normal summon my Sangan. I will allow that. And then I'll enter the battle phase and attack Hain Hain. Attack, inflicting 550 damage to your life points. I will also allow that. Set two more cards. Oh one past my the... lord. Okay. Draw for turn. Oh, what you got? <laughs> what a card, what a card. What I will do first is I'm going to enter battle phase. That's fine. And I'm going to attack the same. Thing. Just as I hold, good thing my Sang is destroyed and now I get to use the effect, which lets me add one monster with 1500 or less attack from my deck to my hand. Oh no. All right, I will search my destroyer golem. <laughs> And for my main phase two, I'm going to set one mysterious card. And I will allow you to go. All right, draw. I'll normal summon my destroyer golem. On the summon of your monster, I will activate the trap hole. Destroyer golem, see ya, trap hole, later. Not on my watch, I'll activate seven tools of the bandit. I will activate the other seven tools of the bandit. I will activate the <laughs> Solemn judgment? Really? God damn it! So my solemn judgment will negate your seven tools of the bandit, which was trying to negate my seven tools of the bandit, which will finally successfully negate your trap hole. Ah, what a play. <laughs> then, I will activate my monster reborn, letting me special summon one monster from my graveyard, and Sangan's gonna come back. And then I'll enter the battle phase. With my destroyer golem, I'll attack your harpy lady. And then directly, Sangha! And then that'll be it for my turn. Your move, Duelist. Your move, Duelist. I'm gonna need something really good to get me out of this situation. For my turn, I'm going to set my mysterious card in face down defense. I'm going to end my turn. All right, draw. I'll tribute my Sangha to the Curse of Dragon. Oh. And I'll use my Sangha's effect, letting me search once again. 
a monster with 1,500 or less attack. This is exactly the reason why I picked my Sangen. It's gonna get my Karibo, and since I'm low on life points, Karibo's got my back. I'm gonna see another turn for sure. Pajuin, I'll search my Karibo. Then I'll enter the battle phase. Curse of Dragon, attack the set monster. It is my Opera Midor with also 2,000 defense. Just as I thought, just as I thought. All right, that's gonna be the end of my turn. You move. Draw for turn. Okay. <laughs> What's so funny, man? <laughs> so for my turn, I am going to place the Aquamador in attack mode. Sword and shield, it must be. It must be, alright. And my next play. What's it gonna be? I'm going to activate the change, change of hearts on your curse of dragon. Oh man, that sucks. Uh, however, I'm not gonna allow that to happen. I'll activate. Solemn Judgment! Oh, no! Another one? You play two? Solemn Judgment on my change of heart? He doesn't even know what I have in store for him now. Well, unfortunately for you, my friend, I also play two of a card. <laughs> what? What card is it, bro? Show me. That you are! That is a second change of heart in my deck to take control of your person. I will allow this son to listen. Ha! Another one. Are you kidding me? A second change of heart? I forgot the card you searched. <laughs> but, I still, will save me. but I still have not normal summon for this turn. See, I know he has that Karibo in his hand, but nothing's gonna save him from two Aquamadors. See ya! So I'm going to normal summon. <laughs> Another Aquamador! Aquamador. And I'm going to enter the battle phase. Curse of Dragon will destroy your destroyer. My golem is successfully destroyed, and I'll take 500 more life points. Aquamador will attack your life points. I'll use my Karibo to protect my life points. And then for my second attack, I will attack. I will use my Karibo! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Good game. Good game. Wow, so close. Ah, uh, yes! Uh, Let's go! Finals, baby! What a cool! No, my red my deck is by far the best. I don't care. Let's go. Yes, got him, Steven, baby. The finals. I told you, I'm coming for his head this week. I got it. Don't worry, guys. We got this. Dark magician, baby. Let's go. Well, Denzel was able to best me. Now let's see if he's able to take it this week. Good luck, Denzel. Denzel, I want you to know something. But just like your trash football team, you're going down, baby! No, we're not doing that. But no, we no, are. No, no. Alright, listen. I'm not it's, gonna do this that. Redemption listen, season. we're not gonna do that. This is the episode. I take it back. This is the episode. I'm on top. Oh, yeah? This is my final trash talk. You're my boy, and I wish you the best of luck, bro. And I also hope you have a great day. You too. Thanks, man. Alright. Rock, paper, scissors? Yes. Rock, paper, scissors. You go first! Let's go. The play Ready? is well for my team. Yes. Wow, I am insane. Oh, so good. I want my special card. I guess I just have to try it. So for my first play. Don't summon knock on my door again. Oh. Please no. Okay. Me I couldn't. Okay, so I'm gonna Thank you. set <laughs> one other mysterious <laughs> face down card. My goal. That's my turn. Draw! Gonna have to. Lobo summon! Skull Red Bird! Ah, <sighs> Skull Red Bird. This guy always drafts this card in his deck. I can't stand that card. Skull Red Bird? No, no, no. Real name of this Yu Gi Oh card is Steven's best friend. And attack if you're a base down monster. And I'll have to put my Hain Hain. Oh, I will send your monster back to your hand. I'm sorry, Skull Red Bird. I will pass my turn. Brave. I'm very brave. I'm a brave next. Draw! Awesome. 
Yeah. He's gonna kill me. Exactly what I am. I'm family. I'm going to normal stuff. Hayasubi! Oh my god! With 1500, 1500 attack. 1500. And I am going to attack your life points directly <laughs> for 1500. 6500 plus. In set one. Mysterious gun fist. Drop! This card signals your doom. It's the best friend. It's not what's going on! That's hard! No. No. Please don't. Is that what I think it is? On the summon. Oh. Please don't say trap hole. Please don't say trap hole. I'm going to activate the Horn of heaven. heaven. Which negates your normal summon by me tributing one monster on my own. Here you go. Skull Red Bird. I love you. So long, Skull, Skull Red, Red Bird. Bird. I'll monster reborn you one day. Set one. Set one. Draw for my turn. And for my turn. I'm going to set one, one mysterious card face down. Yes. Defense position. Yes. And I'm also going to end my turn. Wow. Ha 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 It's not good. I'll stop the face! I used this on Sam earlier. Now I'm going to use it on your monster. So I can destroy it. Hopefully. So what does it what does it? It stop the fence. Flips your face down from his position monster, which is probably Aquamador, because he did me a favor and kept it in your head, and brings it to attack position. Does my monster still gain its effect on the flip? It does. It does. It yes, does. it is activated immediately. Please don't be a good one. Arm ninja. So you get to reveal this? So this is spells destroyed? Oh my god, it's a spell! Oh, 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 oh. oh my god! Yes, Rudder! Two for one, baby! Oh, that's not yes, good! Yes, sir! That's not good. But you know what else isn't good? For you? Go on, son! We went to the Black Forest! From my friend Milano. And I attack. Let's take 800. 800 damage. To the dome! That one. Drop. Drop for my turn! I'm the best card. So, please don't summon a good card. Aqua Door. Oh my god. Am I allowed to summon this? Can you summon it like next turn? Summon it like next turn. You said I couldn't summon it first. Yeah, I think that's fair. Alright, well, you did, you did me a favor. You could set it. Okay. Thanks, man. I guess that one mysterious face down. My turn. I hope not. First off, I'm gonna activate. You fell for my mind trick. I know that's Aquamador. It has to be. Man, Denzel, uh, you having Aquamador. Me having my card here. There's a lot of pain going around. But guess what? Let's share the pain, baby. Get rid of your monster. Share the pain. Tributing my witch of the Black Forest to destroy your Aquamador. <laughs> Let's go. And then witch of the Black Forest will trigger. To add a card from my deck to my hand. That's good. Oh, it is fantastic, man. Let me tell you. Next, I will add. You have three cards in your hand? Hmm. I will add. You ready? You're not ready. I'm not. I probably not. I'm going to add the twin. The Skull Reaper twin? Oh, no, not again. That's right. And then I'm going to normal summon the Skull Redbird. <sighs> and then I attack. <laughs> Go ahead. Draw for my turn. This is another rock on the door. The one card one. that will save me. So for my turn. Don't make it your signature or change your part. I'm going to have to set one mysterious monster. Wow. Okay. I my turn move, Yugi. Draw! Whoa. My next move, my normal summon! Call it a Oh no. Skull Red Bird's boy, they're friends. Let's <laughs> talk with Skull Red Bird. Hey, hey. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to see this card. <laughs> <laughs> <Dear> <laughs> <end>. <laughs> 
Oh, uh, you're a good player, man. I'm gonna have to pass to you. This is I'm, draw. I'm, how many defenses and monsters does a man have to deal with? Put somebody in attack mode. Okay, I'm gonna have to pass. To you. Draw. <laughs> so, just when I thought that my deck doesn't get any better, seven colored fish. Good luck defeating an 1800 attack normal summon. Seven colored. You're dead. Attack. <laughs> In total, 3,000 something. 3,350 damage with my Skull Red Bird and my Seven Colored Fish. I have one unknown set, I have four in hand. This is your last turn, Yugi. Draw for turn. Go <laughs> for you. Oh my, don't do one of those change of heart plays, please, bro. First, oh, no. I will activate. Mm -hmm. The Heavy Storm. Heavy Storm. Destroying all set. You hit my mirror for yourself. and traps on oh, the field. My and my turn is not done with. Heavy Storm, goodbye to his back row. Now all he's got is monsters. And for my next move, with the card that I had drawn. Don't be regeggy. Now, the second part to my strategy. The change of heart. It's the change of heart. Oh my god. Your seven colored fish. Uh, yeah. And that is not it, my friend. Because I will sacrifice oh your seven Oh my god. Fish to summon oh. a monster of my own. Took his monster. Now to summon my second ace card. The Summon Skull. Not as good as the Dark Magician, but he'll just do the trick. Oh my god. The Summon oh Skull! God. To attack the Skull oh. Redbird and send him to the graveyard. And that will be the end of my turn. I'm gonna have to draw, please. If I don't do anything, Summon Skull, please. God, I don't ask for a lot of things. Maybe you lose some weight. Find me a card. Destroy the Summon Skull. <laughs> Ask. Joseph. Earlier in the duel, I said I was gonna monster reborn my skull red bird. Speak it into this existence. Special summon skull red bird. He'll just never let it go. Skull red bird all the time. <sighs> you scared? Not yet. Not yet. Can anyone tell me what's better than Summon Skull? Another one! <laughs> Attack! Here's Summon Skull. Okay. Now it's anyone's game. I'll pass to you, Yugi. Oh, let's go either way. Draw one. for turn! Don't be something good. <laughs> Don't be something good. Yeah, this is intense. <laughs> it is. Three cards and three cards! I'm going to set one mysterious card and I'm going to end my turn. Please. I could lose weight next week. Give me a good card now. Oh, that won't do. I will just put my magician oh, up. Yes, look at your eyes go wide. <laughs> my deck is insane. What are you gonna do? Magician of fate. What are you gonna do? You don't have spell cards! To select the spell card in my graveyard. And send it back to my hand. Sure. And I think, sure, I sure, the change of heart. Sure, Yugi, go for it. And put it to my hand. No problem. Add all the change of hearts you want. Cause I set one card, and I pass to you. Nobody. Should have added heavy storm. Nobody's scared of that card. And you will be. Cause you should be scared of this card. That's unreal. Uh oh. I don't want sound of this. So for my play. I'm going to set one monster face down Thank you. and end my turn. Where are the cards? You know what? I think I know it will. It's a very risky. I don't know if I should do it. Normal summit. Jiraiya! <laughs> 
to that cut, you like points it out. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna use it, but you never know what's hard! It's on Fossey. Oh my god, I think it's hot. Bombadour surprise! Oh my god. This is not good. I'm gonna have to sell one. And you will lose 500 like I'm not gonna attack with Drago more. Are you sure? Yeah, I don't want to lose. I'll pass. Oh, this is so this scary. This match is crazy. <laughs> Draw for my turn! <gasps> What'd you draw, man? So for my mysterious card, I will activate the Pot of Green! What's it do? Draw two cards. Draw two! From my deck! From your deck? Yes! To my hand! Oh my god. Don't draw it. If you draw another change your heart, man, Yugi's on my side. I'm... Kaiba's on my side, too. Is he? I'm just trying to have a good day. Don't double change the card, me. So for my play, I am also going to set two. Yeah, setting two. In the columns of your card. Yes, that's awesome. And I will end my turn. Do you have a summon skull in your graveyard? Do you need it? I don't need it. Because I got my own tributes on it! Summon skull! Tribute summon summon skull for Jurai Momo. Response? Yes, I do. Please, please don't. Let me have this one. Don't trap hold me. Don't trap hold me. Zero. Zero, what? That's a hole. Oh. <laughs> I don't see the hole on the tail. I don't see the hole on the table. <laughs> no hole. I don't see the hole on the table. I don't see the hole. There's no hole. Maybe you left it up a card. Oh my god. Maybe you fell into a hole. Denzel was right, there was a hole around here. I will send him right to the graveyard with my trap. <sighs> that's, that's not good, I'm not fast to you, man. That's, that's not good. Draw for turn! And for my other mysterious card I play. It's a pot of green! Oh my god. I get it! <laughs> oh my god. That allows me to draw. Two more additional cards. Oh. Okay. That's not good. Alright, can't come back from this. So what I will do is activate the change of heart. Sure. Still. I'm not gonna lose any time soon. I'll get it back. Sorry. At least no. What I will do. What do I usually do with your Trash last time monster. You, last time you tributed my trash monster. Oh. Except it's not trash. It's better than every card in your deck. So I think I'm going to do that again. Oh, you do? Oh, okay. Yes. I guess. All right, sure. So I'm going to have to tribute your monster. Goodbye. You're not trash. You're amazing. And summon the cursed dragon. Cursed dragon. Oh my god, not again. Is the summon of the cursed dragon okay with you? Sure. I will enter the battle phase. Sure. And I'm going to use the cursed dragon to attack your life points directly. I'll take two thousand. You're taking 2,000? You have the 4 Tarvin Goblin? And I will end my turn. What's the white points? 30, 50. <laughs> yes. Pass. Yes, sir. Speed draw for my turn. What a card, what a card. It's looking like the end <laughs> is here for you, my friend. But we will not play this game in an aggressive manner. So what I will do is I'm going to enter battle phase and attack your life friends directly with the Curse of Dragon. Do I lose? Oh, and he does. Mirror more destroy Curse of Dragon! Why I did not. That's right. That's right. I don't know why I didn't activate I want to give you one turn. Plan. You're lucky, man. You're lucky. And I will oh, set God. one mysterious card face down, and I will end my turn. No. No one's going I drew the Trinity. Last time I drew three Skull Red Birds. One more happened to my opponent. He 
sitting watching this game now. Oh. And soon you're going to be sitting watching from the sidelines as well. Skull Red Bird, attack your face down defense position monster. So, how many are in the grave right now? Two. Two. Yeah. Well, Trinity, right? Yeah. Send the third one to the graveyard, man eater bug. Destroying your monster and sending it to the graveyard with the other two birds. Have you ended your turn? I have my turn. And I will draw for my turn. I never play scary. So I'm gonna <laughs> <throw that. laughs> spider him to sell. <laughs> and what I will do, which you were afraid to do. I would never do that. Is I will attack your life points directly with Jirai Gumo. And you know what? I'll take it. Let's see if this attack will go. Roll the coin. So when I attack with this monster, I flip a coin. Heads. The attack goes through normally. Tails. I lose half my life points. Yes. So now I get to flip a coin. And I am going to call heads. Oh. And it was heads. 2200 life points. Done. All right. I'm at 800. And then. I will end my turn. Alright. Oh, I'm so good here. That's <laughs> my turn. <laughs> the worst! Let's go! Draw for turn! I'm going to Press. enter the battle phase. Oh my god. And I'm going to. Attack! You're the no worst duelist this ever. You're not I'm winning. Way better than Ben. You're not winning. You're done for. So let me get play out. Then go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sursky. Okay. I'm gonna call heads again with my Jirai Gumo to end you and end this duel. Tails! And I lose half my life points, but the attack still goes through. And your monster. Ah! Not another mirror force. Uh, it's not over yet. It's never over until. It's over for you. And I'm going to have to set one scary. mysterious monster and do my turn. I'm going to normal summon! Mooga Mooga! Oh. No. And I'm going to pass my turn. Okay. Yeah. That's it. That's how you feel? That's it, man. That's it. I'm not serious. Draw for my turn. <laughs> there better be a seven tools of bending. I'm gonna set one. Sure. And then my turn. Oh. Lucky. Draw! Tribute something. For Flame Service! Yeah. Attack. And? I so. said. Troll. Sure. For my next card that I'm going to play. Change of heart. I literally could have drafted this card. Oh my god, it cost me the game. Sure. Take down this sure. I think you like tribute them or something. Exactly. Change of heart. And now to sacrifice my monster and his monster to play the ultimate wizard. And to end him like I should have last week. So I will sacrifice your flame service. Oh my god. Good luck, my friend. And my set manager to summon. Don't summon him. The ultimate winner in terms of attack and defense. Oh my god. The Dark Magician. And to add a little stim pack that will add 700 to his 
was attacked oh by an insult to injury. Oh we will god. enter the battle phase. Oh my god. And Dark Magician and his life. Oh. Dark Magic Attack! <laughs> Let's go! GG! <laughs> I told y'all, let's get it! Dark Magician deck for the win! Let's go! <laughs> Got him, comes around full circle. I knew I'd get him. And to end it, like he tried to end me last time, Dunzo. We got him this week, guys. Victory for the Dark Magician. I told you and we did it. Let's go. Now next week we get a card to make the Dark Magician deck even better than it was this week. Let's get it. Two weeks, two losses in the finals. What am I, LeBron James or something? Anyways. We lost this one, it's all good. It was a blast playing, so fun playing these, despite losing. But you know what, guess what? On episode three, I'm not losing. There's no way a human being can go to two finals, three finals, and lose them all. So next time, next episode, I'm winning it all, baby. I promise that. But thank you guys for watching. It was a blast. We'll see you guys at the top. Um, I felt like I had the best deck in the room, but unfortunately wasn't able to exactly execute, maybe got a little unlucky, but I cannot wait until next episode. Our decks got so much stronger, and I can't wait to see what next episode has in store. Alright guys, so that's pretty much it for the second episode of Duel Nights. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you guys hit the subscribe button and leave a like if you guys haven't already. And guys, stay tuned for the next episode of Duel Nights, where we showcase the magic rulers. Guys, make sure you guys have your bells turned on. Make sure you guys save the day, because Duel Night is insane. I know a lot of you guys have been loving it, and I'm really happy that this series has been so successful, and a lot of you guys tune in every other week to watch us go at it, sending each other to the Shadow Realm. Man, I had so much fun. Grandpa, where are you? I'll see you guys next time for the third episode of Duel Nights. See you then. All right, guys. Peace.